Hi, good evening. How are you, classmates? Hi, Ada. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hi, Adita. Hi. You are, your microphone is. Okay. Good. Good. good evening. Good evening. How are you, Adita? Fine. It's fine. This day is. How was your day? Mm. It's good. It's good. My day is good. And in, in this moment, uh, un poco no sé cómo se dice, uh, un dolor de cabeza, sí. But, no. but it's good. Okay, yes. better. But are you eating better? Excuse me? Are you feeling better? Yes, I have a little headache. Yes, but but is as um, leve. It uh, it's good. But the headache in general is um uh, is some point. Yes, este, in particular is, is leader, o sea, así. Yeah, but it's, it's not mm -hmm. good. Mm -hmm. Hi. And other time is very, very, uh, headache, así, very, very. But in this moment, it's leader. Mm. No sé cómo se dicen, yo creo. I, I think maybe is the este, hot, eh, very hot in this day. In, in my case, for the stress. Eh, mm -hmm. Oh, but it's, it's not good, Ada. Mm -hmm. The different level of the headache, it's not good. Oh, pero, eh, but, eh, cuando es muy fuerte. Eh, yes, horrible. It's horrible. But in this moment, no. I, no. I hope you will be there. Thank you. Maybe it's possible. Do you need more rest? Rest? Descanso. Ah, okay. Yes. Possible. In this, in this. Mm -hmm. Relax. Relax. Relax, yes. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Two. Hi, classmates. Good evening. Okay. Someone Thank else you. speaking. Thank you. Nobody wants to speak. How was your day in general? I don't know who wants to answer. <laughs> Nobody, nobody wa wants to talk. You have to be more direct. Okay. They are, they're shy, they're shy. Yeah, they are shy, okay. 
Okay, I'm going to speak. Hi, Rosalena. How are you? Hi, good friend. How are you? Uh, so tired, but I'm tired. ready to learn a little. Tired of why? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yes, it's, tell it's, me. it's difficult. Today is Wednesday. Mm. The half of the week. Yes, but in my in my company, we have this this week a uh, shutdown. We stopped to produce, but we can use a uh, many report that the boss or the boss need to give to his boss. Then uh, yesterday it was so so tired, so tired because we need to finish um, in my company. I, I work as a, as a supervisor. So in supervisor, then we need to make some meeting with the people, explain, the, explain yeah. explaining, for example, uh, action plan to improve the quality, efficiency, to improve the attendance. Oh my God, you, you do many things. <laughs> yes, but yesterday I arrived at home, I saw so tired, um, but, now it is so like yesterday, but it 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 was so so less less stressful than yesterday. Okay, nice. But what about you? How was your um, day? I can complain. Today I have an a medical medical appointment with my mother. Because I I had a <laughs> oh my god <laughs> yeah I have a problem with with her the last week because she had she had a high hypoglycemia the, his her pressure her her glucosa no her glucosa how do you say glucose glucose, glucose. yeah her glucose down. Went it's down about. in 50. Went down to 50. 50. It's very, it's very dangerous. Yeah. It's very dangerous. And yeah. today she has a, a control with the, yeah. with the doctor. She had a, a, a control. But thank God, everything was okay. Excellent. Um, road. But, about to hear that, but I, I hope that your mother going yeah oh, yeah it was very, well. very difficult oh my god it was a, a moment the last week that I, oh my god i never have have been in this situation, this situation? yeah yeah it i was, can imagine this so, it so difficult very, for you it was very difficult but thanks uh a friend of mine he helped me he helped me uh, uh, by telephone and i I look for a, a, oh my God, how can I say? Um, um, oh my God. No, I have a, do you I want do to say? Immediata help, immediately, immediately help. help. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Jen. Uh, yeah. And did next, you get it? The next week, uh, she is going to, to take, um, a control with a uh, endocrinolog endocrinolog just, I don't know endocrinologist endocrinologist yes but in in that case it's very very important the control of the food yes yes the, the, a, a good diet yeah yes she's going mm -hmm. to be on diet to, yeah. to reduce that all risk everybody at home are in diet <laughs> Okay, great job. Good job. Hey, you see, you can talk a lot. It's just a matter of some technical words. I mean, that's yeah, okay. Yeah, there are some, some, some words difficult. <laughs> technical vocabulary yeah. that, that, that you will learn eventually. I mean, but you know what? To learn technical vocabulary, you have to work using it. Um, yes. By experience, I can tell you, I know about airline jargon about insurance jargon because i worked on that uh software and i mean hardware hardware jargon on on computers what else let me think oh now and and now uh financial terms 
uh, things about credits and oh and it is related with insurance as well you know theft felony imagine, uh, robbery imagine imagine talking talking about medical uh Medical terms. Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah, medical jargon. I not only blow pressure, but uh, heart attack. Oh heart attack, God. a stroke, attack. a yes. seizure. You know what seizure. is a seizure? My seizure. My my oldest child. He's starting four years and studying medicine. He's on his fourth year studying yes. medicine. Yes. So he's starting to but, become a doctor. Yes. Wow! Nice. I, I hope so. That I, 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 I hope so. I hope so. Don't that. do it. But, do but it. I, I remember um, two years ago I bought uh, some books, medical books in English. In English, yes. Nice. But I start to check it. But it is a, it is a, a different vocabulary because in general we we are talking over there in uh, common days. But when you talk about Andrit, on, in Spanish, what do you, how do you say? Endocrinologist, endocrinolog I think. Endocrinologist, <laughs> imagine. Can you imagine say in English, uh, otorino laringologo? <laughs> yeah, that's endocrino endocrinologist. Let me see. Endocrinologist. Yeah, it is interesting vocabulary. It's difficult, uh, but you, you can make good money. You can make good money um, if you know some medical vocabulary. Nurses, nurses in Canada, they are well paid. Even if they don't know how to speak English or French, um, you, if you are a nurse in Canada, you, you can make good money. N not to mention if you know English. Not to mention if you know English. That's, that's really good money. And they're always in need of those. Um, you said Otorino. Oh. Otorino Larilongolo. <laughs> oh my God. Super califragilistico. Teacher in Spanish is difficult in English. More difficult. Yeah, it's more difficult. In English, Fredo. Otorino. Otorino. Sí, no, sí. The, the Otorino word, Laringologo. Yeah. The, name, the name it is Otorino Laringologo. But I, I, I remember that sometimes a, a friend told me, hey, you can say otorinolarilongologo. But he, did. Oh. I, he was joking with me. But that, I, I remember I, I, I couldn't pronounce this word. That's crazy. It's too much. But there's another way. There's a... There's another way, ORL. The abbreviation is ORL. Sometimes some some, te some technical words can be abbreviated. <laughs> Thank God. More easy. <laughs> oh, come on, more easy, easier. Oh, sorry. <laughs> My God. Don't worry. That happens to me. That, that happens to me as well. But man, I mean, for me, for me, can you imagine a teacher saying more easy? Oh my God. No. More. <laughs> no. <laughs> I know. Okay, turn on your to, camera. I need to back to the first. Level. You gotta go back. I gotta go back. I gotta go back. Come on, no, Rosanna, you're okay. Okay, let me do the attendance. It's eight fourteen already. Great job. Thank you guys for talking. That's amazing. Ada Patricia Linares Galdames. Present. Anacel Micheves. Present teacher. Teacher Adriana Stefani Martinez Flores. She's not here today. Let me do that. Okay. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Present. Flor de Maria Carvalho Ugarte. Present. Hey. Gabriela, Gabriel Ignacio Lara. Did it again. Oops, I did it again and he's down here. Okay. Gabriela Alejandra Gonzalez Flores. Present. Thank you. Gloria Elizabeth Linares Galdames. Here. Hey. Julia Patricia Vasquez Santos. Present. Thank you. Carla Verónica Vasquez de Rivas. Present. Thank you. Nelson Edgardo Sánchez Ramírez. Present. 
Great. Ofelia Orellana Arce. Here, teacher. She was here, yeah. Pamela Beatriz Posada Reina. Pame. Oh, Pame is connecting right now. Okay. Roselena Salgado de Serrano. Present. Sandra Gladys Méndez Ramírez. Present. Okay. Stephanie Elizabeth Ayala Pérez. Susana Carolina Hernández Iraeta. It's not here yet. Okay. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present. Good evening. Good evening. Thank you. Wendy Patricia Molina Duarte. She's floating right now, I know. Sorry. Oh my God, Wendy. Hope you're doing good. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. It's raining cats and dogs in Santa Ana in my hometown. It's raining cats and dogs. It's crazy. Uh, Wendy is getting flooded right now. Her house got flooded. And she is with the combo taking the water out right now. My brother, my brother sent me a video. He was driving in a river. I mean, the street was a river. It's crazy. The, the weather is, is... Yeah, it's, it's, imagine the hurricane in Miami. It was, oh my God. Mm -mm. Yeah. And it's not only the wind, but also the water. The water, the overflow. Oh my God. No. Both the water. Hold on, both the <laughs> water, the water, the wind, and also, and also. the electrical <laughs> shocks. You know, the, yes. I, my brother lives in Tampa. I'm really concerned really? about him. Oh. Yeah, <gasps> no. he's in Tampa. Awesome. And you know, you know what's the worst thing, Rosalena? Yeah. Not only he lives in Tampa, Tampa. but but also he's tiny. <laughs> he's a dwarf hey christian if, if you ever watch this video i'm gonna send you this video i know you're gonna laugh yeah my, my brother is like one meter one meter tall you know he's gonna kill me because he he, he can speak english as well of course he, he lives there he, i love him he works welding you know it's very, it's very oh, admirable. Nice. His story is very admirable. Man, do you know that welding is well paid in the States? Yes. yes. Welding. All the, all the, oh my God, all the work, the works. Yeah. The all these works, all these specialized jobs. Yeah. 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 Are, are very, have the demanding, I think are on demand yes are on demand yeah like the people that paint houses now he doesn't weld i i'm let me correct myself he doesn't weld he's a superintendent now he that you know what he does he's always looking for workers Mm -hmm. and, and he never right. finds he never <laughs> finds it's so difficult i mean yeah. he's in, he's in florida and sometimes they say they the boss goes like hey uh we need pipe feeders for example pipe feeders it's it's just the way it sounds a pipe uh -huh. and they have to fit it put it together Ah, but it, okay. but but the pieces have to match yeah. and then they weld i think uh -huh, or okay. they do it with pvc pvc as well mm -hmm. so the thing is that he looks for uh how do you call this a squad just like the movie okay mm -hmm. <laughs> he looks back for a squad man and, and they offer them deems so difficult for deems you know they offer them um daily deems i think that's the way you say it and and those deems are like a hundred dollars per day so imagine that just a hundred dollars per day i mean it's crazy of course you have to work like 12 hours a day non-stop i mean it's really hard but man it's really good pay and the other job that is running out of workers or which um how do we call this labor pool, I like that word. This labor pool is, is going down is drivers, truck drivers in the United States. Man, if you're a truck driver and you go to the States, you make good money. 
nowadays, do you think you need a special training to to be a truck driver? I think that, of course, because imagine uh, taking the control of the, a big a big truck. Mm. I don't know. Do you, I think do that you is drive? not easy. Do you drive? No. No? Uh, oh, no. okay. Huh. What do you think, Wilfredo? Do you drive? Yes, of course. Do you think it's the uh, same to drive a car than driving a micro bus or a pickup or, I don't know, I a have, big truck? I, I have a drone, pickup, microbus, and coaster. Coasters too? Yes, I, I have a cousin that he is a driver, uh, Metapan, uh, team. Hmm. Yes, but um, two years ago, he came to visit. Then he, he I, I remember I, I, I saw the, uh, try to, to parking from my house. <laughs> yeah, yeah, what's up, what's up, what's up, man? <laughs> hey, what's up, coach, you told me. Yes, then we, we go around Santa Ana. Yeah, man. Do, do, you, do you want to drive it? Oh, of course, yeah, over there, baby. Then, a um, camion. A truck? A camion. Truck? Yeah, a truck? Yes, uh, say toneladas, I remember. I six tons, to six tons. What? I went to um, a friend told me that hey, can you drive please? I need to go to Chalatenango to move some things. They, they, they are going to change house. No, but I go. They were going to move. They were yes. moving. They were moving. They, they were moving. Were you speeding? Uh, excuse me. Were you speeding? Uh, speeding. Driving, driving fast. No, 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 no. I so slow. And when I, when I start to drive a big, big truck, I only check in the, the mirror. But... Yeah, it's, it's just that you have to dimension, you know, the size of the truck or, or the, the car that you're driving. Well, Edwin, Edwin is a driver. He knows about that, you know, man. And you have to know the vehicle. If somebody lends you a vehicle, Know the car first. Know the car first. Because I, the only car accident I have ever had um, was, well, my brother was driving. So, and I didn't tell him, you know what? The direction is very loosened. It's very loosened. So when he did a, a turn to go by another car, go next to another car, um, he, he did that, you know, he lost control. So we, we hit a, a tree. We hit a it tree. Is, it is so dangerous if you lost Very your control. Very dangerous. Teacher, Most but I, I had a, a good experience riding, but with my brother, we drove from Los Angeles to Las Vegas. But it was an interesting trip because we drove Through around the desert. In six hours. Through yes, the desert. Yes. I mean, but yeah. driving, driving six hours in the States for, for Americans, that's like normal i mean picture that picture that driving from los angeles to to las vegas is six hours and here in el salvador driving from santa ana to la union is like what three hours three hours three, three hours. hours yeah we're so small <laughs> okay yes, it is a, it's a short distance man you just remind me i, I was re-watching i was re-watching casino with robert de niro Yo, pitching. yes i oh was my God. I was in Mirage Casino. In the Mirage Casino, really? I I, I was there one week. My, my I, I have two cousins that they, they live in Las Vegas, but wow. they they paid a estadía. Are you saying in? Uh, they their stay. They paid they paid their stay where? Yeah. Uh, at, okay. a, at a hotel. The, yes. Did you yes. win in the casino? Did you win no, in the casino? Did you I, actually I, play? Did you gamble? Yes, I, I, I tried to win, but I, I, I didn't, didn't, didn't win nothing. I, I lost uh, $15, dollars but I, 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 I stopped. I, I can't stop because I need to stop. Oh, my God. That's addictive, they say. Okay. No, I, I did. I, I haven't. I have not. I, I, I have never played in the casino because... 
I, I don't know how. My wife, just say it, Wilfredo. My wife kills me. Just say it. My wife will kill me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't do that, guys. Gambling is not good. It's not good at all. It was an interesting trip. An interesting but, trip? Yes, the Las Vegas Boulevard is yeah. a beautiful place to... Nah, know, just someplace. going anywhere in and out of El Salvador may be interesting, I'm sure. Okay. <laughs> okay, guys, you have a job to do tonight. Uh, we are 16 right now. Um, you must, you must prepare. Um, what was it? The name? Oh, a training needs assessment. A training needs assessment, based on the last class. Um, the different ones that I send you: observation, questionnaire, interviews, focus groups or documentation, either one of those. You have to choose one um, needs assessment technique and apply it in a theoretical way, you know, but you have to um, describe, for example, I just had the idea of applying um, an observation needs assessment um, technique because uh, um, at the call center, the job that we perform right now in theory is easy, but something happened recently. And as a company, we have to block 10,000 cards and replace them because somebody hacked, somebody hacked uh, 10,000 digital cards, an approximate amount. So we, we, we suspected, we suspected the system the system rate rose a flag. The system rose a flag. I hope you're paying attention. The system rose a flag that there were too many transactions, let's say through Google Play. Too many transactions from Korea, from Hong Kong, from from Br British, you know, British transactions uh, from London, UK, and all of them were digital cards. So that was a trend. That was a trend. So we, our system rose the flag and said, ding, 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 alert, alert. So we had to block 10,000 cards. And the Rosa flag feature is um, less level of the red flag on? No, no, no. Oh. <laughs> the past of, Rice, rice, rice. Did I write it? Yeah, that's in past. Past participle. Rose a flag. Rice, rose. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. That's the way you say. Se activó una alarma. Okay, it's not like an alarm got activated. That's too long. I don't know. <laughs> but that's the way we call it in the job. You know, it's like a flag, a red flag. Uh oh. Okay. So the system automatically blocked 10,000 cards. What happens next? An email is sent to the owner of the card, the digital card. There's no plastic, it's just a number on your email. And the customer receives the email. And the email states, if you don't recognize this transaction or transactions, please reply to this email with this documentation. And then I receive the email and I start working, creating a case, you know, asking for more documents, validating the data and giving back the money. That's in simple words, that's the way it works. Now, I'm just giving you this example. So my observation will be taking 10 agents, 10 uh, workers and observing timing, okay? I use my stopwatch and I start, I start observing. In fact, we call it side jacking. That's the way we, we call it. We start side jacking agents, taking times. Okay, start, stop. From the moment that he starts, he receives the email, 
to the moment that he creates the case and closes the case. The moment that he puts the money on the card. That's it. So that's me. That that's I took the time. I took many samples. Now, my goal is to set a goal, set a goal, a reasonable goal, a reasonable goal, a more achievable, a more achievable goal. Bien, vuelvo a la pregunta. ¿Quién entendió? ¿Quién entendieron? ¿Alguna aclaración? Teacher. Uh -huh. I, I understand and I understand about that. I understood. In center, yeah, understood. For example, in a call center, you have to, you need, you have to make a transition. Transition? Transition. And you have a, for example, five minutes. Mm -hmm. And you have to, to do when, if you, you have a, a flow um, alarm. An alarm, uh huh. An alarm. Yes, you have to to you have to be so re ready to to answer, for example, an email, and give a, some answer about that. Mm -hmm. And then you you have to. Um, um, I uh, let me let me let me explain. Here. No, no, but what I'm what I'm wait wait wait. Yes, that's related to someone taking calls, but the example that I just gave you, the description of my. Um, needs assessment technique, you know, what I'm going to do and the reason why I'm doing it, you know, the explanation. Did you understand everything? Let me see. Mm. Walter, ¿podrías explicarnos en tus propias palabras para ahorrarnos tiempo súper rapidito en un par de segundos? ¿Qué entendiste de lo que dije? En español. Oh, ok, teacher. Entendí que estaba hablando de... de... De la de que había ha habido una había una larva. Creo que estaba hablando, no sé si de alguien de Estados Unidos. Uh -huh. O su hermano, no, 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 no entendí mucho. No, no, en Estados Unidos, ajá. Ajá, de que se, se activaba una una alarma. No sé si mencionó tiempo. A ver, ayúdenle uh -huh. a su compañero, todos, todos. Estoy viendo comprensión, ¿eh? Les dije ayer, les puedo estar tirando una historia para que agarremos el hilo y empecemos a trabajar en base a eso. Hoy nuestra tarea es crear lo que yo acabo de hacer. O sea, que ustedes repliquen ese ejercicio. Aplicar una de las técnicas de... de, de ¿Cómo se dice? Una de las técnicas para observar o de las diferentes técnicas que tenemos para medir Sí, las técnicas evaluativas, ese es el nombre, las técnicas evaluativas de, de, para determinar si hay una necesidad de entrenamiento en un trabajo. ¿ya? En mi caso, yo el ejemplo que les he dado es de poner una meta. O sea, mi, mi, mi punto en esa, en esa técnica, al usar la técnica de observación, va a ser fijar una meta más razonable, les decía. So, a ver, ¿cómo lo voy a hacer? ¿Quién entendió cómo lo voy a hacer? En pocas palabras, lo que entendieron. Midiendo el tiempo razonable para poder definir la meta. Midiendo el tiempo eh, cabal, ¿verdad? Para resolver, por ejemplo, un, se activó la alarma, usted tiene que resolver un, eh, en un tiempo determinado y usted puede cronometrar en cuánto tiempo el, resuelve la situación. Sí, porque algo... Ajá, ajá. Oui. Y en base a eso se puede hacer un, un, un assessment, que es un, un checklist, por ejemplo, hizo esto, esto, esto y esto. Pues si esto no se puede hacer. Correcto, que... correcto. Ahora, la idea de tomar tiempos es muy factible en, en, en cuanto a, a medición de un proceso a la vez. O sea, si, si, si mido el mismo proceso varias veces, la lógica me dice que voy a tener variables resultados, pero muy semejantes. Y en especial si lo hago con más de una persona que hace el mismo proceso, la, el promedio va a ser bien justo. Pues o sea, tomo unas 10 muestras, 5 y 5, dos personas, que son mis puedo tomar y eso es cosa matemática tomo a alguien que es mi top performer y el que es mi bottom performer incluso alguien de en medio o sea pero ese es otro rollo el punto es ese ocupé la técnica de observación para definir si hay eh, o sea para evaluar si hay necesidades de entrenamiento dentro de ese proceso nada más solo un proceso no hablemos de una posición entonces su tarea ahorita va a ser esa tomen pónganse de acuerdo en el grupito 
y necesito que desarrollen esto nada más. Una explicación. Vaya, eh, no sé. Vamos a, a crear, a ocupar la herramienta de cuestionario. ¿Qué es lo que vamos a investigar? ¿Qué es lo que vamos a investigar? Vamos a investigar si la gente está de acuerdo con los 15 minutos de receso que se les dé en la mañana. Si son suficientes. No sé y el cómo, cuestionario es ¿no? survey. A survey. Yeah, that's a synonym. Uh -huh. That's right. Select Questionary question. survey. That's right. Questionary survey are synonyms. That's right. Mm -hmm. Survey, survey. It's possible to design the a short survey. Correct, the short story. Just narrating. In, in our job, mm -hmm. we had an issue. We used to give 10 minutes, a break of 10 minutes for the um, people on the production line. You know, uh, the operators used to have 10 minutes to go for a break in the morning for a coffee or something and go to the bathroom. But many of them were complaining that 10 minutes was not enough. So we run, we conducted a survey, okay? And these are the results. Some people said, da -da 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 -da. yeah, good. Questions? Ahora, quiero que sean muy enfáticos en el hecho de determinar por qué esa opción es mejor. Por ejemplo, ¿por qué un survey, un questionnaire es mejor que eh, los focus groups? ¿Por qué los focus groups? Yo podría decirte así de lleno, eh, un cuestionario es más fácil, lo pueden dar en su casa, el empleado sin gastar tiempo en la empresa. Y ahí está. ¿Ya? Focus groups, hay que sacarlos, hay que pagar el tiempo. Mm -mm. ¿Ya? Esa, esa, el, ese, el, ese análisis hay, quiero que... Ajá. Hay que definir quién va a estar en este foco para... Uh, a lot of grupo work. focal para que nos dé la información que requerimos. That's a lot of work and money but for the company. The different techniques. Techniques. Uh -huh. Depend of the, the technique, the different techniques of um, assessment uh, needs of mm -hmm. training. Depend mm -hmm. of the depend of the the goal. Yeah. And the, it depends the on what you're looking or, for. Or the selection. Yes. What's your uh, objective? They depend on the objective, yes, as well. It depends mm -hmm. on the objective. So I'll send you one by one to your WhatsApp so you can have them handy and you can make up your mind with your groups, determine what will be the best option. Okay. The most important uh, is to determine what's going to be the scenario. What scenario are you going to use Okay. in groups, okay? I'm sending you one by one these things to your group. Let me divide you right now so you can start talking, okay? Really quick. Nadie se queda acá en este grupito. Por favor, todos nos vamos. Let's go. Let's go, girls. Let's go. Uh, what do we have to do? For me, yes. What? Did you stand there? What do we have to do? Mm, not really. <laughs> uh, we have to, so, we have so. to make a questionnaire talking about if the people are agree with 15 minutes to break. No, that was just an example. <laughs> what? Ese solo fue un ejemplo, Will. Para oh, que ustedes, okay. o sea, que ustedes tengan una idea de qué es lo que podríamos hacer. El punto es utilizar una de las herramientas de medición yes. para determinar qué necesidades de entrenamiento existen dentro del trabajo. Ah, um, ok. Era un caso práctico lo que les estaba poniendo, lo de los 15 minutos. Ah, um, ok. 
Okay. Okay. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Okay, my choose choose topic. Choose topic mm. for the the question. Um, uh, let me let me see. We have to we have to make a um, for or or we have to analyze analyze. For example, if that what what um, what kind of training that people need, and I, I don't know any any process to improve it. Uh, uh, I don't understand this Let me see. <laughs> uh, for example, I am. Uh, um, let me see, Nelson, for example, in your work, if you need to in your company, you need to improve some process. <clears throat> Do you know what kind of training that people need to receive? And we need to we need to use some techniques about to, to, to development, some process or or, 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 or training. Yes, uh, that's sad is the, in the moment uh, there are different uh, uh, process uh, established in, 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 in when when the, the employee develop um, implemented and why and why explain why you choose this technique to the class and what are the expected results. Okay, so uh, what I was explaining you, well, it was an example. The 15 minutes break, the 10 minutes break is just an example of a situation that happens at work. So what technique, what assessment would you choose to resolve that situation? Uh, okay, teacher, we are clear. We that apply the any technique, but my question is the when say define the is is a scenery, uh, we 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 do the the um, we do the the case. Uh -huh. As a group, you have to formulate. A scenario, you know, create a scenario. Uh, for example, let me make it simple for you. Everybody in your plant or in your job, they are always arriving late. Okay. And then when payday, when payday comes, everybody complains. Why did I lose the Septimus? Why did I lose my Septimus day? This is mm -hmm. not fair. This is not fair. It means that they don't know the law. No entienden la ley, no saben que existe el reglamento interno and all that, right? So the first step will be to identify, wait, these people doesn't know the law. Do they know? So if I want to know and I have 50 employees, am I going to stop the production and go, hey, you cannot be late, right? No, it's better to explain step by step, right? Okay. Okay, so that, okay. that's the idea. Just think about it. What I care about is you applying one of the techniques, the interview, the focus group, the documentation, the questionnaire, whichever you want, okay? Okay. Good. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, guys, uh, the first step is 
うん Yeah. I think the situation we were thinking, we were, oh my God. No idea. What kind of, what kind of situation? I shouldn't have said scenario or situation. I should have said something like, I don't know, let me think. Oh. Laura, do you know how to fire somebody? You know how to fire somebody? Say goodbye to an employee? Uh, yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. So are there other managers in your job? Yes. Do they know how to fire people? Very. <laughs> Okay, so let's pretend that they don't know. Okay, mm -hmm. how do we find out if they know? Which tool can we use? A questionnaire or what about a documentation technique? Focus groups. Hmm. If you have 10 managers, you could do three groups, you know, make trios. Right, and have one modulator, you know, one person modulating the, the, the training, and then do the focus groups to find out if they need training on letting go people, on firing people, or the opposite on hiring, hiring people. That's a good idea. Right? Okay. Rosalina? I'm, I'm reading and I'm thinking about many situations at work, but <laughs> because we have many situations. But, yeah, but, but not, not, I shouldn't have said a situation. No debía haber dicho escenario o situación. Yeah. Sino lo que le acabo de explicar a Flor. Digamos, otra vez, más fácil. Okay. Um, tengo 10 gerentes y me pregunto como jefe si ellos sabrán despedir personal o contratar personal. Se puede en el proceso, conocen la, el reglamento interno de la empresa, los prospectos que pide la empresa, requisitos y todo eso. ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo yo sé que si lo saben? Pues para eso sirven esas herramientas, ¿no? Es prácticamente una investigación lo que voy a hacer, una investigación de campo y hay diferentes mm. maneras de hacerlo. En base a eso voy a determinar, ah, no, 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 necesitan aprender cómo despedir a alguien, técnicas para despedir a alguien. Así se voy a poner al entrenamiento, técnicas para ah, despedir. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How to avoid being killed when firing people? Como evitar ser <laughs> que te maten cuando despedes a alguien. Okay. Could be. Ah, okay. Okay. Okay, teacher. Okay. okay, you got it. So, el punto es definir qué, qué técnica voy a aplicar y por qué elegí esa técnica. Recuerden okay. que hay diferentes variables. Hay unas que son más caras para la empresa, otras que no incluyen un costo. O sea, ¿sí me explico? Mm -hmm. okay. okay. Think about it. Okay. Come on, girls. And then, yes, it's possible the, the uh, disadvantage that the questionnaire maybe is possible. Uh, we don't have the enough information. Yes. Yeah, it's 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 so much better in an interview in an interview. <laughs> you drink a lot of water, teacher. <laughs> I'm trying to. I have like wow three point three point eight liters. I have to drink a lot of water. I'm trying, I'm trying to. Hey, so what's your scenario? Well, I no, please, you, you. okay. Well, we are trying to to uh, get a solution to have a better environment in a workplace. At work. Mm -hmm. Wow. So we are we are uh, we are going to use interviews. Mm. Because we. We think it, it's better because we are 
facing uh, the people so they cannot like or get the easier answers as they do in a questionnaire. Uncovering details of training needs as well uh, can explore and anticipate the issues that come up. Now, the consequences, the bad part of this is time consuming, difficult to analyze, needs a skilled interviewer, mm, and difficult to schedule. You're taking your employees out of their schedule. Think about it. Now, to have a good environment at work, I need to know, I need to have people skills how to be patient, anger management. <laughs> Do you remember that movie with Adam Sandler? <laughs> anger management, control de la ira. Um, what else? What else? What else? What else? Oh, uh, conflict solution, conflicts resolution. Yeah. But in in our case, teacher, uh, the 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 idea is to get information to improve the specific areas of the environment. Excellent, example, excellent. What I'm telling you is the different options that you have of training. So you want to determine what training fits better your employees. Excellent, you got the idea. You got the idea, Anderson, very good. So you will go like, okay, what is the problem with um, Gabriela, Julia? Oh, she's always talking about me, gossiping, you know. Gabriela, Gabriela is toxic, very toxic. Okay, so how to deal not with teacher. others? I mean, no, no, I'm just picturing, I don't know. So, not teacher. No. Yes, I understood, but no. Okay. No. No, in this case, no. to get information, for example, to improve the facilities, the common facilities, for example, the the area for the launch, for example, the, the condition of the office related to the, mm -hmm. the furniture, for example, or the, or the, okay. the, 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 the lighting. Uh, yes, what is that? Light, lighting, lighting or illumin illumination. Okay, or, or so the, yeah. This is part no, of the no environment. Me, yeah, I know. Solo que no me expliqué, no me expliqué bien, chicos. I'm sorry. Uh, si se fijan, dice, define the needs of assessment technique to be implemented and why. Eh, o sea, tendría que haberles dado un ejemplo no tan práctico, sino que el hecho es identificar qué áreas puedo entrenar. Yo pensé que iban a preparar el personal con un cuestionario, ah, perdón, con entrevistas, con entrevistas para determinar cuál de los trainings que acabo de mencionar suena más uh -huh. lógico. Sí, resolución de conflictos, control de la ira, como hasta ahí ah, hay okay. entrenamiento que creo que se llama cómo lidiar con personas tóxicas. Resolución de conflictos. Resolución Entonces, el, de el conflictos. Training, el training que podríamos utilizar, no, la técnica que pudiéramos utilizar para identificar esa necesidad. Exacto. O sea, su meta va a ser dentro de estas opciones de training, cuál encaja mejor en los resultados que voy a obtener de la técnica que voy a implementar. Ahora elegimos entrevistas porque la gente es más sincera. Otras cosas surgen que tal vez nosotros no habíamos contemplado, ¿verdad? Al terminar las entrevistas. Eh, nuestro trabajo sí lo permite, nos permite ir sacando empleado por empleado, generar un cronograma y ver cuántos empleados por día podemos tomar. La producción está baja, así de que vamos a tomar ventaja de esa situación para ir sacando cinco empleados todos los días. Fulana es experta, es psicóloga, ella se encarga, ya les hice todo. <risa> Take no <risa> That's right. Sí, sí, verdad, eso se quedó claro. Right? Okay, right, teacher. Okay, okay. super good. Continue. Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you. This is going to be a, an awesome exposition. Thank you, girls. Thank you. Yeah. Okay, Shane. Shane, the, 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 how do you say, context. Yes. Um, in this case, the, the, it's possible that the better is the questionnaire mm -hmm. because we need to get information about the what is the main problem related to the environment? For example, the, the conflict, the resolution of the conflict, or what is the other, say the teacher? 
Yes or not, y why. Okay. And second question, I can... Uh, Okay, okay. And the and the one question is uh four sentence. But the four sentence uh, uh, va para va para uh, alimentación podría ser. And the one question is uh, do you agree uh, with your salary? What? And the one question do you agree? With your salary, you yeah. Did you agree? Did you salary? Are, are you agree? Are you agree? With are your you salary? Agree? Ah, yes, yes. Are, yes. You, okay. agree? are you agree? Are you agree with your salary? Yes. Are you agree? Ahí le vamos a poner un sí no. Si es no. Yes or no? Why? Yes. Ajá, cabal. Ahí viene el, el so why. No, why? Are you agree? Did you agree with your salary? Yes. Teacher. With <laughs> Did you agree? Salary, salary or payment? Sal salary, salary. I said in, in the inbox. Are you okay? Ah, are you okay with your salary? Yes. Are you okay are, with? Are you agree? Yes. Are you okay? Uh, you say, and with the agree? Yeah, uh, see, uh, sí, no se puede. Are you agree? Uh -uh. Do you agree? Do you agree? Do you agree? Mm -hmm. Do you agree? Ah, okay. You agree. Uh, are you okay? Si quiero ocupar el verbo to be. Porque la uh, énfasis, el do you. Uh, uh, do you uh, no, uh, así se hace la pregunta. Así se ocupa agree en una pregunta. Do you agree? Or do you disagree? ¿Estás okay. de acuerdo uh, o estás okay. en desacuerdo? O sea, que era así como lo había puesto yo de principio. Do you agree? <laughs> yes. Remember, there are many different ways to ask the same thing. Okay, okay, great job. So you're trying to find out what? What's your scenario? Um, yes. that people, the people are disagree with their, their salary or they, their payment. People disagree with their salary. People, you could also say people are in disagreement people with or, employee or, employee. or employees are in disagreement with the salary. I'm okay. People yes. are in disagreement with the salary. Okay, so you want to find out why. Okay. Ahora, quiero que no pierdan de vista que dentro de eso tiene que surgir una necesidad de entrenamiento. ¿Ok? ¿Qué necesidad de entrenamiento habría ahí? La ley o hacer un cuadro comparativo de esas posiciones y cuánto ganan eh, a nivel nacional. Tal vez hasta hacerles ver, ¿verdad? Que se les paga más o, o se les paga arriba de lo, de lo que exige, el, eh, no sé, el Ministerio Bien. de Trabajo o cualquier cosa. ¿Bien? ¿Sí? O, o está ganando igual que una secretaria y un contador y no es, es, o es mínima la diferencia. Uh -huh. O sea, ese es el punto. ¿Qué necesidad de entrenamiento va a surgir de todo eso? Le leí el cuestionario, lo va a tirar. ¿Ya? Ok. Good job. Keep going. Okay. Ok, my friend. Eh, vamos a responder la pregunta o solo la vamos a generar. Sí, porque, porque ya escribimos una, tú y yo, no, pero la vamos a responder o no. Es lo que yo pregunto. Sí, si es, es que ahí ah, está, yes or no. Ajá, ¿A solo no. sí o no? Ya pasó. Ok. Ok. And so, and the annual leave schedule. And the problem is they do not allow you to schedule vacation immediately after the year of work. Uh -huh. and another, and, and another point is they do not pay you in advance for vacation. And they send you your vacation without 30% uh, 
Right. And without and without payment of the scheduled days. And you yes. receive the payment once you return of vacation. Was big problem because you are you go to vacation without, without money. money. Yeah. Uh -huh. sí, okay. verdad. ¿Qué más le podemos okay. agregar? En cuanto a las aparte, dificultades, aparte, creo que eso, las dificultades sería eso, pero eh, lo, el procedimiento a seguir podemos... Ajá, ese, ajá, ese, ¿cómo es el procedimiento a seguir? Porque según el, el, lo que hemos agarrado, tenemos que seguir el procedimiento. Correcto. Entonces sería no esperar a que los empleados le pidan. Mire, es que recursos humanos tiene que tener un listado, ¿verdad? Con, uh -huh. con pues, de los empleados. Eso es lo ideal, pero eh, no, no esperar a que los empleados exijan sus vacaciones, sino que ya tenerlos. Pues, eh. Una calendarización de, de quién se va Ajá. primero, quién se va después. Ajá. Ah, correcto. Eso. Ajá, muy bien. Ah, porque si no se hace un desorden a la hora que Ahora, no pueden juntarse. Los que todos... Sin perder de vista lo que están hablando, que es súper excelente. Glorita o todos, no sé, ¿quién, quién me dice? ¿Qué, ¿Qué necesidad de entrenamiento habría ahí de parte de recursos humanos? Eh, eh, conocimiento de las leyes laborales, en primer lugar. Ajá, o el, el, ¿cómo se llama esta cosa? El librito de... El lo que le, de trabajo. No, 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 lo que tiene la empresa. Eh, el regla, reglamento interno de trabajo. Okay. En base okay. a la ley, o sea, ustedes el del 30%, uh -huh. tra, 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 esto dice la ley, incluso un cuadro comparativo, o sea, ese tipo de entrenamiento estarían buscando ustedes como uh -huh. resultado de, de la investigación que llevarían a cabo. ¿Y qué, uh -huh. ¿Qué método van a ocupar para investigar? Ahí vamos. <laughs> ok, va. Sí, es interesante. It's very interesting right now. Ok, keep going. Thank you. Thank you. Y podrían ser este las, las interviews. No va. No. Read, read, read the interview pros and cons. Okay. Good. Station. Vale, pero lo que yo entendí ahora ya fue algo diferente además de dar las, las ¿cómo se llama? las recomendaciones es la sí, ser profesor eh, la capacitación dijo, de recursos humanos entonces no es yo creo que podemos usar el focus group because, porque es un uh, you really need no mm -hmm. yes. how do you say specific specific. Yeah. Ah, specific specific yes the specific yes. point that you want to know yes only you are only you need mm -hmm. uh, the data can be collected for, from a large number of people Yeah. Um, yeah what else? This um, is it, bro. It's all good. Oh yeah, and, yeah. That's uh -huh. that's the reason because we, we choose that. Uh huh. Yes. Okay. The next the next point. Let me see. Ah, oh, explain why why we choose. Yes. Explain yes. why you choose this technique to class. Ah, what 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 are the expect results? Okay. Um, I think we know that the things or oh, the results that we want to obtain is now as yes. oh my god is How you say when when you when you cuando tu, cuando pones like uh, los puntos como, como ponderarlos, no sé cómo se dice eso, ponderación. Ah, Así como que, le das, como que le das más peso a una parte, entonces es como... Una estadística. Podés, no sé cómo se diría eso. Más o menos. O un porcentaje a cada punto. 
Una no, pregunta. Sí. Eso, eso. ¿Cómo así? Por ejemplo, como, como la intención es que hacer un cuestionario, este, porque querés puntualizar en lo que más te, te interesa saber de, de tu empresa, de tus empleados. Entonces vos podrías ponderarlo para los resultados. O sea, a eso me refiero, que vas a seccionarlo, pero no sé cómo, cómo se emplearía eso de la ponderación. Que es, el, que es la finalidad de, de la herramienta que van a utilizar. Uh -huh. Determinar qué es lo que necesitan, en qué necesitan instruir a sus empleados. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Por ejemplo, ya hablaban de las vacaciones. La gente se anda quejando porque les pagan el 30% hasta que regresan de las vacaciones. O no sé, el salario completo hasta que regresan de las vacaciones. Y, y muchos, son muchos los que se, se, se quejan de eso. Entonces con, voy a llevar a cabo una herramienta de investigación que va a determinar qué porcentaje de la población, o sea, de, de, de los empleados, eh, no conoce el reglamento interno ah, del okay. trabajo. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. Y en base a eso, en, ajá, una muestra, en base a eso voy a determinar, ah, bueno, le voy a entrenar en base al reglamento interno ah, del okay. trabajo y el uh -huh. Ministerio de Trabajo. Hasta voy a traer a alguien del Ministerio de Trabajo para que me apoye y haga, y haga ver a todos los empleados cómo uh -huh. es el proceso de vacaciones. Uh -huh. Okay. O sea, eso, okay. ¿qué necesidad uh -huh. tener de entrenamiento? ¿Será solo la ley o el, eh, el reglamento interno? Con eso estará. Ya. Ah, okay. Okay. Sí. Good. Okay. Ah, okay. ok. Entonces, hablando de nuestro caso, ¿qué queremos? Que el personal conozca más nuestra empresa. ¿Qué hacemos? Aparte de conocer nuestros valores, misión, visión, ¿qué hacemos? O sea, si somos una empresa de servicios, ¿qué servicios ofrecemos? Porque muchas veces ni la recepcionista sabe. Yes, Entonces, eh, eso. ¿Qué ganamos con, con pasar el... el... Ajá, ¿qué, ¿qué resultados esperamos? A ver, ¿qué tanto conoce la empresa? Like, like, uh, every three months. El document es love. So, I think, I think it is, is a communication problem because we, we are not communicating the things correctly. Mm -hmm. That, that's yes. right. Yes. Yes, it's a problem, but it's important to identify what is the main problem. Yes. That's right. Yes. Okay. But we are agree? No, we agree. We yes. agree. Do we agree? Mm -hmm. Yes. Vamos, no? el, el anuncio no? de yes. Do we all agree? Yes. <laughs> Do you agree with the technique? With that technique? The questionnaire? Raise your hand. Yes, right. <laughs> okay. 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 We change. We change. <laughs> okay. In the lack, other, lack of an effective communication channel. Lack of an effective communication channel. Se ocupa el artículo an. No puedo cuantificar eso, verdad? Eso yo lo escribí. <laughs> Okay. okay. <laughs> lack of an effective communication channel or lack of effective communication. Okay. Una de dos. <laughs> okay, good. Okay, saben que vamos a tener que regresar un minuto para pasar el listado. Okay. Thank you. Thanks. Okay, 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 okay. Parece que muchos estaban pero bien emocionados con este tema. 
Y créanme, esto es de, uf, largo, ¿eh? Largo. Parece que Pamela está teniendo problemas con su audio y video. Él estaba. Bueno, ok. So, eh, solo los traje para pasar el listado. Luego continuamos porque yo sé que no han terminado. Voy grupo por grupo y he notado que están bien interesados en el tema y les está quedando bien bonito. So, before we move on, again, a la Patricia Linares Galdames. Listen. Oh, there you are. Thank you. Adrián Estefan Martínez Flores. Ana Selmi Chévez. Present teacher. Edwin Alexandre Alerazo. Present. Flor de María Carballo Ugarte. Present. Gabriel Ignacio Lara. Was around here? No. Ok. Gabriela Alejandra González Flores. Present. Gloria Elizabeth Linares Galdames. Here. Julia Patricia Vázquez Santos. Present. Carla Verónica Vázquez de Rivas. Present teacher. Nelson Edgardo Sánchez Ramírez. Present teacher. Ofelia Orellana Arce. Teacher. Pamela Beatriz Posada Reina. Roselena Salgado de Serrano. Present teacher. Sandra Gladys Méndez Ramírez. Present teacher. Stephanie Elizabeth Ayala Pérez. Susana Carolina Hernández Iraeta. Present. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present. Wendy Patricia Molina Duarte. Se desconectó, pero bueno. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. And Will was having connection problems too. Okay, guys, I'll split you again so you can continue with the same group, okay? Una observación a todos. Ya se la dije, pero recalcando. Present teacher. Thank you, Wilfred. <laughs> okay, una observación súper rápido. El meollo del asunto es determinar qué necesidades de entrenamiento existen en base a los resultados de la herramienta que voy a aplicar. Se aplicó un cuestionario, se apliqué grupos foco, lo que haya hecho tiene que darme un resultado y por ende de ahí puede salir una necesidad de entrenamiento. Dentro del ejemplo que les pintaba de los 15, 10, 15 minutos de, de receso, quizá una necesidad de entrenamiento sería eh, el manejo del tiempo. Entrenar al personal sobre el manejo del tiempo, el buen manejo del tiempo, ¿ok? So, Ánimo, sigamos y pues volvemos para sus exposiciones breves, ok? Really quick, super good. Walter, ¿en qué grupo estabas? En el número uno, donde está Wilfredo. Nelson. Ok. Got it, thank you. Thank you. No estamos más. Ok, continuo. Almost, almost we, we are going to finish the, the report. <laughs> no, si, okay. es, si es necesario, pueden hablar en español. No se preocupen, el punto es comprender. Uh, Super good. Yeah. We, we don't speak Spanish, teacher. <laughs> <laughs> ok. Uh, okay. Uh, I think the, 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 the when, when the, uh, training is expense control. Training. For, for example, if, for if, example you, yeah. we, if you are going to talk about training, could be the, I, I guess, if the people are disagreeing with their, their payment, a good training to solve this situation could be that the people need to receive a financial training, for example. Yes, financial training. Oh, yes. But, but, 
uh, and the employee uh, need more salary because in, in, in the in the topic is the the employee are disagree with salary payment in, in, in the yes. in the yes. in, in, but, but when when the when uh, writing expensive contract training I not resolve never the salary the uh, the employee it is signed uh, it's besides but, o sea, queda uh, lo mismo. Sí, o sea, está bien, va. Nosotros tenemos esta idea, pero del control de, 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 su, de su economía, Ajá. De la, de, de, del manejo de su, de, de su finanza, pero la idea lo ¿cómo, que necesita. ¿Cómo ayudarle? Ajá, o sea, este podría ser, va. Que la empresa puede decir. El, 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 el topic is in generally. En, Ajá. Uh, Pero podemos buscar specific. otra, podemos buscar otra. Ok, Esto, con eso creo yo que ya finalizamos, entonces. Creo que sería todo. Falta es la presentación. Y ya se acerca el día. ¿Quién va, ¿quién, ¿Quién va a decir qué? Ah, ok. Ah, ok, ok. And last role play. Hagan de caso que ya están en la exposición y, y pretendan decir lo que les toca a cada uno para ver cómo sale, ok. Ah, muy bien. Okay. Eso no lo hemos compartido ni lo hemos discutido que vamos right. a decir cada uno. Uh, that's the point. Okay, keep going. Okay. Thank you. Okay. No, but Susana, Susana tell, tell something more. How much? Uh, is the knowledge the employees about, about the company? Uh -huh. how, how much no. the employees? Now the company. Now the company. Okay, how much? How much? How much the employees know the company? Okay. Yes. But but the first I say or interesting is we are interested or the, the company have the interesting the media to measure? No, measure is media. No, no to say. El interés de la compañía es medir el conocimiento. Because you yeah. have a, um, yeah. la capacidad. Es cuantitativo. Knowledge. 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 In med Pero es como medición. If you want. Dejamos que la empresa tenga que interés. And the next, we choose the questionnaire like, can we choose the questionnaire? Okay, the, okay, and the, oh my God, the assessment, assessment, the assessment, uh -huh. the technique, technique assessment that we are going to use is the questionnaire. The questionnaire, why? yes. Why do, why do, why do we choose that? Why because because result um results results because result um how would you say podemos because result I confirm the if the los resultados pueden confirmar la eficiencia la eficiencia de the results the results can confirm the efficiency the process induction, the induction process. Ah, okay. Uh -huh. The results, the results uh -huh. can compare the efficiency in what? Yes. In communication interna, institucional. Ah, the, the efficient, the efficient with the, uh -huh, with the. About the process. Induction process, induction. And communication to process. Okay. The resource. human resource. Uh, 
the results can confirm the the efficient. Maybe can we say the efficient? Of the teacher say results can confirm of the much the efficiency of the internal ah, communication. Their communication. Yes. <laughs> yes. The efficient. I'm just trans I'm just translating. I'm just Thank translating you. what Susanna is saying. <laughs> okay, I'm just translating. I don't know the topic. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. <laughs> yes. Okay, uh -huh. what else? What else? If you process was Elena induction in communication. Per results uh, more easily, easily, more easy. Easier or more easily? Easily. easily. And did you say did, did you say we can compare uh, results? The okay. results. The results. Results. More. more. Result with easily. S. Uh huh. Easily. Results more easily. More easily. I'm sorry. Oh. Yeah. More information. Say that you get part of the song. And also, we are we we save money. <laughs> it's a good yes Ad advantage. Yeah. Okay. What else? In my opinion, depend of the structure of the questionnaire, it is possible to reduce the disadvantage or cons. It's possible because, for example, in that case, lack detail, but depend because it's possible to prepare a um, questionnaire and where uh, the, the answer uh, gives more detailed information. In my opinion, depend of the, the, the preparation of the questionnaire because the the question is um are you happy yes or no it's not detailed yeah answer, but in the case uh, um choose that the better option for you that 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 you get yeah. more information yeah mm -hmm. and actually i think it is an advantage that if we say time uh, making or trying to get the, the, the information that we need, uh, we can use the time that we are saving to prepare a good questionnaire, right? Exactly. Mm -hmm. Exactly. In my opinion, it's possible to change the, the count to pro. Yes. In the other advantage that you previously said is uh, the response uh, will be anonymous. Oh, um, yes. So mm -hmm, yes. we can get uh, honest answers from, exactly. the, from the employees. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh, I forgot how to write answer. <laughs> um, 
Is that the way? Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes. Okay. Thank you, teacher. Okay. Yes, I think this this last one is a really important one because uh, as we were saying, sometimes the pro the problem are or the main problem are the bosses, and if you get an opportunity to talk or to speak about it in in anonymous way, you can like be more open about your opinion, I guess. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yes. Yes, it's true. I agree with you. <laughs> Yes. Yeah, you know it's true. Uh, uh, um, I love you. Dun, 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 dun. And mini vanilla and the new kids of the block. New kids of the block. Yeah. yeah. Step that. by today, step. Today by step but oh, today. baby. Oh, come on. Really? Yeah, so <laughs> oh, no, no. Backstreet. Yeah, so <laughs> Backstreet. Back. So yeah, I danced. I danced that music, but I, man, it's just, I was a romantic boy, you know, when I was a kid. I, I used to send letters. Oh and my you, God. You, you want to laugh? You want to laugh? When I was in fourth grade, I got traumatized. I was in fourth what? grade. Oh I God. sent I sent a letter to uh, to Leslie. I know the name Leslie. She was beautiful. Don't she was it. tall. She was white <laughs> and curly hair, curly brown hair. She was beautiful. You know what she did? Mm -hmm. She she returned the letter to me with the grammatical errors corrected. <laughs> I was a smart, like, oh, a smart yeah. girl. <laughs> And you know what? My dad still has that letter. Really? Yes, he My kept God. it. He kept it. And he told me whenever someone laughs at you or corrects you, just do your thing, you know, accept the correction. <laughs> Se imagina un niño de, de 10 años que su papá le diga, cuando alguien te corrija de esta manera, <laughs> que te de traumado para toda la vida, <laughs> acepta la corrección. Y le hice caso. <laughs> wow. And I learned English. Wow. <laughs> I don't like or orthographia yet. Still, I don't like orthography in Spanish. Okay, chicos, una, un breve anuncio de dejarlos que, que comiencen uno por uno, que sé que están bien emocionados con esto. Eh, necesito que todos se pongan las pilas con el midterm. Hay bastantes estudiantes que um, ahorita les, les he enviado algunos un mensaje directo acá en Zoom. No sé si algunos ya lo vieron o no. Pues por ser, por ser, um, ¿cómo se dice? Se corrige en privado y se felicita en público. Así. Ah, pues eso. 
cuando yo quiero corregir la mayoría, pues se los digo como lo estoy haciendo ahorita, ¿eh? La mayoría está con este problema. Déjenme ver. Ya prácticamente a todos les envié el mensajito y... Oh, my God. Ahorita en privado les estoy el mensajito nada más para que tomen conciencia. Ok. So, let's see. The first group. We have Nelson, Sandra, Walter, sorry, and Wilfredo. I, I don't, I didn't understand that. The, the indications. Correction. The correction. The, Do the platform. Go to the midterm exam on your platform. Let me see. Where for computer are check? You? Are you complete? Let me see. Anna, send me chairs. Yeah, you, you made it. You got 100. Yes, the last week. Thank you, you very much. Hey, Will. Teacher, I, I, I tried from yesterday or, yesterday. or, 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 or Sunday. I, I started to, mm -hmm. to try to, to complete, but um, exercise, exercise number two. I send you the answers. Really? Yeah, on the chat, right, guys? Yesterday, yes, I, yesterday. yes teacher. Yesterday, mm -hmm. I sent us. <laughs> he sent us. I'm sorry. You send, <laughs> yeah, you send, send it, send it. I know. You know what? Uh, ayer tuve ah. un funeral. Ayer fue a dar servicio en un funeral en la batería de velado y dije, ah, le voy a enviar las respuestas. No se supone que debo hacer eso, pero ese estaba algo complejo porque a veces dicen los puntos. It was puntos. very, very use, useful. Useful. Yeah, for me because I compare because I have um <laughs> the lot the. All the answers was where with, a, with where with a different word and mm. your help. <laughs> that helped to correct yeah, yourself. That awesome. Me. Yeah. Awesome. Um, okay, Thanks. teacher. Uh, today I'm going to be. Um, yeah, after the class. It doesn't take that much. Yeah. Acuérdense que pueden hacer el examen varias veces, okay? Todos los exámenes los pueden repetir hasta sacar mejor nota, okay? Okay. You can do it. You can do it. Okay, let's go with Wilfredo's team. Uh, Nelson, Sandra, Walter, and Wilfredo. One, two, three, action. Okay, teacher. Oh, everybody. Sorry, class. Um, and we we are the, the group number one, and the topic is um, assessment the salary, because the, uh, any company uh, uh, they are uh, the, the employee. And disagree with your salary, and in in base uh, the topics I uh, I I have the I do we we do in the in the studio. Está? <laughs> Sorry, okay. I, uh, I share sharing the the screen. Give me a moment. I must see. Wow. Mm -hmm. Okay, sorry. Okay, sorry. This presentation, assume the salary. Uh, the employee are disagree with the salary and on the payment. Why uh, we? We we group uh, uh, take the wow wow I'm oh, sorry <laughs> I no <don't> remember <laughs> what uh, in the strategy or or technique technique uh, but uh, the study uh, is uh, questionnaire. Okay, uh, the employer disagree with the salary or payment with uh, uh, or people is not not uh, not agree uh, because they have the different um, question in the the payment or uh, uh, what. And the in different department apartment no is same in the salary. Uh, uh, so, so anyone uh, loved 
uh, order is is high in by, because uh, the the employees uh, are disagree uh, mm. what? can i help you also me. you help me please i'm okay uh, teacher we were talking about that uh, or and some comp and some company people are disagree with the salary. Then we we have a we had a, a survey or like a assessment. But what what need people need to cover with their salary? Then we 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 could see, for example, people need to cover payment about bills. People need to pay their full uh, scholarly children. Then we talk about um, we were talking about what the people need to do to cover their needs. Um, the assessment told us that the people need to receive some training, for example. Um, what kind of people what kind of training the people need to receive? But about that, Walter and Walter and Sandra. They talking about they they are they are they are talking about that. Walter. Resume. Okay, excuse Resume. me, excuse me. And the, my group see the at the the different question is a. Uh, um, and number two is, uh, are you wearing the pie according to your professional? And the company, and uh, could we people, and, and no, do you have notes and agreed for salary? And the, and the question is, uh, are you getting payment according to your professional? Is, Yes or no? For example, the company, uh, all the people, and and good and could be uh, a, a, a yes according to your salary per professional. And the people cover their needs. Uh, Yes or not? For example, not. It depends on the people. And we had a uh, appointment. The 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 according a priority the the house the the now the the family. It's different. And, and then uh, what skin training people and need to receive? Uh, and my group, for example, and yes, is a training people in Newport City. Uh, for example, an education is who is who how do you say como saber gastar su salario? How do you say teacher? Excuse me. To know how to spend your salary? Okay, to know how to spend the salary. And is, is that what, what you have written there? Spends control training. Okay. Spence control. Okay, thank you. Continue. Continue. Sandra. 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 Our, our groups is a uh, a topic assessment uh, the salary and uh, how to resolve uh, the 
the, quest, the questionnaire is a uh, evaluation training, training financial for the employees and in evaluation to uh, you, they degree, they degree, uh, for example, a uh, uh, salary secretary, uh, but a uh, 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 content generally, a uh, uh, evaluation uh, on evaluation the salary, uh, in uh, establishing the why uh, contribution the 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 organization in in according the the work only teach that's it okay yes. <laughs> that's it very good good job so um, study, pronunciation, study, study, questionary, difficult word, questionary, questionary. But if you manage the word question, questionary, questionary, the employees are disagree. Ya les voy a enviar una presentación sobre el uso de agree y disagree. Ok, eh, hay diferentes maneras de ocuparlo, pero sí, cuidado con los auxiliares. Con el verbo to be, I can only use I am in disagreement. They were in disagreement with me. To say I agree, I disagree. I cannot say I don't agree. I have to say I disagree. Ok, I'm sorry to disagree. I hate to disagree, for example. Uh, that's the area of, of improvement that I have noticed in many of you in this class. We need to learn to use agree or disagree. Okay, good job. So salary, salary. Yeah, people always complain about their salary not being enough. And yes, training someone on how to use their money. That's important. That's cash flow. You have to learn to do a cash flow every month. Okay, group number two, Ada Patricia, Edwin, Gloria, and Carlita. Okay, good evening, teams. Uh, we are a uh, uh, group two. Our case study is annual lead schedule. Then Ada Patricia will expose the problem that we have identified. Okay, excuse me. Um, well, I will tell you the problem of this case. They do not allow you to schedule vacation immediately after the years of work. They do not pay you advance for vacation. They send you on vacation without 30% and without payment of the scheduled days. And you receive the payment once you return from vacation. Next, Edwin. Hello, hello good evening. As uh, Patricia, uh, Patricia says, we, we see the, pro the problems that she mentions. Uh, we choose uh, the assessment technique of focus group. Um, as the first thing that we do to resolve these issues is um, uh, invite the members uh, of the company, as a simple, the manager, uh, the accountant, and the most important human resources to. Uh, to, to to a meeting, we invite these these people, so we we um to, to resolve these issues. So uh, at the end of the point, we talk that we are going to listen to all the uh, employees 
employees asking uh, a couple of questions, a few questions, I'm sorry. Then the alternative to resolve is uh, give them all the, the vacations depending uh, uh, of the data that the, every, every employee has getting to the company. And we hear uh, all, the, all, all the answers. So um, we focus on, on, on the manager and the manager work together with human resources. Then uh, get, we're going to get, give the, the vacations to all our employees. Okay. okay, the training needs are labor law training, rules of procession, work call. Uh, the training is necessary for better stability and good labor relation uh, between employee and the company. That is recite. Okay. That's it. That's it. Good job. Okay. <laughs> Super good, guys. Hey, you know what? Many people make the mistake of saying vacations, vacations, or some say vacations. Um, it's difficult. That word is is not easy to learn. Let's say, uh, first word: receive, receive, receive. Okay. They. Vacation, 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 vacation. There you go, vacation. Okay, and again, receive vacation. Technique, 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 technique. And the last one, relations, relation, relations. En serio. Hay muchísimas palabras que terminan en T I O N. Y si tú las practicas como Shen, esa T I O N, las practicas como Shen, Shen, te vas a oír bien pro, bien nativo. Entonces, education, relation, vacation, uh, filtration, I don't know. It, did I say education? Yeah, already. Okay, inflation. Man, there are so many. And next group, we're still running eight minutes. Great job. So we have Flor, Ophelia, Wendy, Rosa, and Susana on the next group. Ready? Okay, come on. Okay. <laughs> okay. And um, we are the, the group number, I don't remember, <laughs> four, three? Oh my God. Number three. <laughs> okay, we have oh, yeah, we have the scenario. Um, measure employee knowledge about the company and the technique assessment. The assessment technique that we use or that we choose was the oh my God. Let me question questionnaire. Questionary, oh my God, so difficult word. Questionary. Uh, uh, Flor, Flor is going to is going to explain what do we choose uh, this technique. Okay, uh, we will use the questionary to measure of uh, no knowledge because it is easy to applicate and verify the efficiency of the induction and communication process. Next, Susana. Okay, thank you. Well, um, the objective use assessment technique is questionnaire is confirm the efficiency in the process of induction and internal communication the company. According to result, we evaluate if continue in this way, or if we will improve the communication channels. 
It's all teacher. That's it. Sorry, that's I'm going it. to. That's I'm it. Going that's to, it. I'm, yeah. going to, I'm going to tell something else because we use the questionnaire because it's, it's not expensive. It's, it's, okay. it's, nowadays, it's easy to, to prepare one of them. We can we can choose many tools at the at the websites and, and yeah we can prepare in a few minutes and the, yeah and the the results they are tabulados <laughs> tabulate tabulated yeah okay the the results can be summarized yes mm -hmm. the yeah the results can be easy to understand. Uh, okay, that's that's it. <laughs> now it is. Okay, okay. Good job. We choose. We choose this option. Uh, there is no. What is it? We chose. We chose this option. One O. We chose this option, or we have chosen this option. We've chosen this option. We've chosen. We've chosen. We've chosen this option. Okay, floor tool 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 to determine i love this to determine the efficient the efficiency efficiency of the induction process good idea i mean wow can somebody measure i don't remember my induction in the company where i work <laughs> it was like one minute welcome that's it okay <laughs> so it's confirmed somebody said it's confirmed it's to confirm, Susana, is to confirm, we evaluate if continue in this way. We evaluate if we continue in this way. Hmm. 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 Okay. I can analyze porque se me olvidan los sujetos en algunas oraciones. Not the first time. Good job. Good job. Last group, Gabriela, Julia, and Pamela. Okay. Uh, good night, everyone. Good evening. <laughs> okay. Uh, we our scenario our scenario is uh, about a hundred employees, and we are trying to define, or we are trying to. collect the information about lack of effective communication. And the technique that we are going to implement is the questionnaire. Why the questionnaire? Uh, well, because we can get more information in an easier way uh, because it is an uh, as as Rosa said it is an easy to prepare a questionnaire nowadays. And also we can say time because we are not uh, taking a lot of time from the employees so they can continue working <laughs> and doing money. And also because uh, we can compare the results more easily. It is uh, easier to get all of the information and to prepare the report, uh, and in that in that way to get the information that we are looking for, and also uh, that we save money because it is the uh, less expensive way to do or to collect information because uh, we can ask uh, to our AT department to prepare the questionnaire. It is easier. <laughs> and also that we can get an honest answer because they the employees are are going to make this questionnaire in a anonymous way. So they can be honest about which is the problem or where they can 
identify the problem because uh, I I told to my uh, to my co to to my uh, I, I I forget the word was I was saying <laughs> that we uh, sometimes the, the main problem are the bosses but if you make an, an anonymous questionnaire the, the employees can feel the confidence to say it uh, without feeling like they are getting in problems and that's it getting in trouble awesome very good let's see Julia, effective, drive, strive, ok, me acabo de sentir como el negro de white chicks, de las, ¿dónde están las rubias? Ok, let's see, we scenario is, our scenario is, our scenario is, again, effective, it is an easy to prepare nowadays. Estaba nerviosa. It is an easy thing. It is an easy thing to prepare. It's an easy, it's an easy thing to prepare nowadays. It's so easy to prepare this thing nowadays. Okay. Um, to get all the, the information, to gather all the data. Eso es una observación en este campo de encuestas y cosas se dice. Gather all the data or data. All the data. Okay, we can also we can ask to an IT department mm -hmm. to the IT department. We can ask the IT department. We can ask to the IT department. And the last one, identify, 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 identify. Okay, awesome, y'all. Wow, I hope you're learning. This is a very interesting topic. Super bien. Bien, recordarle de nuevo, quienes no han terminado la plataforma, hasta el midterm, por favor, terminarlo ahora para que me quede subiendo las notas de los que faltan. Ya me jalaron el aire. Eh, se tiene hasta el 5 de octubre para que envíen los documentos para el siguiente módulo A2. Eh, ¿Qué más? Eh, eso. Eh, quiero ver. Um, me quedo esta noche. Con Susana Carolina, no, Susana estuvo conmigo, ¿verdad, Susi? Susana, ta, 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 Susana, Susana, me muero por tu amor, no está. Ah, como no, ya la vi. Susana se quedó conmigo el, el um, ¿sí? You're breaking up. Tuesday. On Tuesday, right? Yeah, you stood on Tuesday. So I'm staying with Walter. Did I jump someone? Me salte alguien? No, no, okay. I'll do that later. So Walter Mauricio, 10 minutes, please. Yes. Bien, guys. Gracias por estar conmigo esta noche. De verdad se los agradezco. Les ruego que se queden unos 10 minutitos más los que no han terminado la plataforma. Cualquier cosa me escriben si necesitan ayuda, okay? Ada Patricia Linares Galdames. Present. Espero que siga mejor. Take care. Thank you. <laughs> Adriana Stephanie Martinez Flores. Ay, no, hoy. Ana Selene Chévez. Present. Good night. Edwin Alexander Ayala Erazo. Present. Good night. Good night. Lorde María Carballo Garte. Present. Good night. <laughs> Good night. Gabriel Ignacio Lara. Gabriela Alejandra González Flores. Present. Good night. Gloria Elizabeth Linares Galdames. Here. Good night. Julia Patricia Vázquez Santos. Present. Julia, thank you. Good night. Good night. Carla Verónica Vázquez de Rivas. Present. Good night. Good night. Nelson Edgardo Sánchez Ramírez. Present. Good night. Good night, Nelson. Pamela Beatriz Posada Reina. Here, teacher, Ophelia. Oh, Ophelia Reina Arce, oh my God. <laughs> Thank you. Pamela Beatriz Posada Reina no pudo solucionar su problema con el audio, creo. Okay. 
Roselena Salgado de Serrano. Present. Thank you. Sandra Gladys Méndez Ramírez. Present teacher. Thank you. Good night. Stephanie Elizabeth Ayala Pérez. Susana Carolina Hernández Iraeta. Present. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present. Present. Wendy Patricia Molina Duarte. Present teacher. Thank you. Espero que ya haya solventado el problema con inundación. Sí, teacher. Va. Se fue okay. el agua. <risa> bueno, primero Dios que todo salga bien. Wilfredo Guardado Rivera. Present teacher. Ok, guys. Good night. Enjoy the night. Have some rest. Good night, buddy, and rest hey, a lot. Good night. See you. Good night. See you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye, my friend. Bye. Hey, teacher. Walter. Hey, yep. good evening. <laughs> okay, teacher. And I thanks for for you giving the the opportunity the uh, the class. For me, it's good. And I can see the other teacher. And do you have not a uh, a uh, Preocuparse por los alumnos. <laughs> oh, yes. Um, imagine and the, the teacher is at uh, the level intermediate. Oh, my God. What uh, is a good, is a good English. <laughs> no, thank you. Thank you, teacher. Oh, you're welcome. You're welcome, Walter. Uh, bien, vamos a aplicar estos 10 minutos por ser nuestra primera sesión en español. Un poco de lo que me decía, I thank for you giving me the opportunity. I thank you. Cuando ocupas thank es directo con alguien. Ah, oh, okay. Sin a ese. Tiene que ser thank you, thank her, thank him, thank me. Ajá, con los pronombres. Vea. Y oh, okay. el otro es thanks en general. Ah, oh, ya, yeah, ya. Yeah. Sí. Oh, okay. thanks, thanks a lot. Así en general. Lot. Ok. Uh, let's see. Y lo que yo suelo hacer en esta sesión cuando estoy por primera vez con alguien es hacerle dos preguntas. Eh, la primera es, ¿cuál ha sido su experiencia con el inglés? ¿Ha estado en inglés corporativo desde el básico 1? Sí. O yo, yo sin, con... sin mencionar otras yo... academias, si viene de No, no, no. Yo soy un producto de, del inglés corporativo porque yo comencé de, de cero, digamos. Mm. Yo, va, imagínense que yo voy a cumplir 40 años. Va. Y yo comencé, estudié inglés desde que dejé el bachillerato. Yo salí en el 2001. Uh -huh. Creo que en el dos, ajá. Desde entonces yo ya nunca volví a estudiar inglés. Hoy que me metí a esto, que un amigo, eh, mira, no está. Ah, dije yo, yo me metí por decirlo con él, como por fregar. Al final, como entró la pandemia en ese año, se suspendió y se comenzó como a finales de ese año de la pandemia. Y así he logrado continuar. Para mí ha sido un poco difícil porque no, no tengo así como todo el tiempo. También como te tengo, tengo, tengo hogar y todo, quizás si yo me hubiera implementado más antes y todo, quizás tuviera un nivel mejor. Yo logro ver en mis compañeros que ellos, los que hablan más o menos, yo cuando tengo la oportunidad de ir a un cuarto, a un bathroom, yo les pregunto que ellos han estudiado en otra academia, en inglés, que han estudiado en otra academia, y ellos uh -huh. me dicen que sí. Y hay muchos que sí ya lo tienen. Yo no, yo... Por eso que también me cuesta un poco más. A mí hay veces en la conversación y todo. Pero sí siento que he aprendido. Siento que si yo le dedicara un poquito más, quizás estuviera un poco mejor. Siento que con, con, con ustedes estoy aprendiendo a escribir. Estoy aprendiendo uh -huh. muchas cosas porque fíjate que... Con, uh -huh. hay, me he tenido profesores, yo sentí uno que... O sea, me tiré el, el módulo de Choto, creo que fue cerrando el 5, en el 5 creo que fue del internet. No sentí que aprendí nada, solo ponía a leer y a leer. Y recuerde que, que hay unos que sí logran captar mucho, pero uno es menos. Casi solo en párrafo, nunca nos metió a, a, lo, a los cuartos así. Ahí sí tiene, ajá, ahí sí uno tiene oportunidad de platicar, de preguntar. También tuve un profesor que ese era, me gustaba porque siempre que en la, en la noche, yo me conectaba cinco minutos antes, ahora ya estaba ahí. 
Mm. He, comes, he comes out and, hey, hi, what, uh, tell me, uh, how are you week? How are you day? Y, y uno intentaba, ¿verdad?, hablar con él. Y poco a poco le iba yendo por lo menos para decirle, ah, me fue bien, <risa> eh, tuve mucho trabajo, a, 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 a cosas bien sencillas, sí. pero me, me, me manejaba bastante. Eh, eh, tal vez lo que no tenía era corregirnos. Porque mm. tal vez lo escuchaba y tal vez no. Uh -huh. O tal vez lo decía, eh, pues sí, lo hacía, pero era más poco. O quizás no sé, porque quizás no hablábamos mucho. Pero, Algunos pero, profesores dentro de este curso eh, tienen miedo de corregir a los alumnos. O oh, no, no sé, es, puede yo, que yo, sea solamente. Yo pienso eso. que solo lo hacen ayunos como que solo lo hicieran por, o sea, por dinero. ¿no? Son poco los que se preocupan por decir, bueno, ¿qué aprendo? No, no puedo opinar en eso, pero sí. Ajá, te digan, Dentro de mi experiencia, yo sí he visto eso. Yo sí he visto eso mucho en muchos profesores. De ahí, los de acá no puedo. Decirlo, Ajá, ¿no? Yo, yo, yo logro ver que uno. Embargo, ojalá, de que, ojalá de que usted continúe con los. Para, para mí. Conoce, no sé si conoce, conoce a Douglas Arevalo. Sí, 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 sí. Ah, él, vaya, él, 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 él me llevó a mí como desde. Como cuatro o seis módulos crucé con él. Sentí que iba y iba con él. Cuando a mí me, me dejaron por cualquier motivo, uh -huh. yo sé, continué con, con, con otro profesor a ese ya no le. O sea, ya no, ya no, no me sirvió mucho, pero igual va ahí, ahí va aprendiendo. El que tuve pasado para cerrar el intermedio era otro moreno, cigar, cigarán. Era el apellido moreno, joven. Este, sí se mira que tenía un poquito, pero no hace la, no sé, pero siento que con usted si llega a continuar, tal vez no voy a terminar hablando así, que, ah, qué bruto. Me ha gustado, va. me ha gustado el grupo, honestamente, Walter, que, que se han enfocado, o sea, han logrado estamos llegando a, a alcanzar eso de, de la comprensión del tema, que es lo complejo dentro de estos niveles. A ver, ya no nos queda mucho tiempo, pero le, le quiero enseñar algo. Ese link que le acabo de enviar a su WhatsApp. No, ah, sí, aquí lo miro. Eso ya, ya se los había enviado WhatsApp también al grupo, pero si usted me dice que su problema es uh, pronunciation, pues esos son audios. Ahora, ¿cómo los aplico? Voy a tomar un cuaderno solo para eso o imprimo la hoja. Son más de 250 conversaciones, no discrimine o si quiere llevar un orden. ¿verdad? Ese es un, un índice principal el que le envíe. Dentro de ese índice principal hay subíndices por cada tema. Y luego puede, sin discriminar, agarrar uno. Ahora, número uno, no me importa lo que dice ahí en español. No necesito saber eso. Entonces, agarro esto una conversación por semana. Los primeros dos días, Walter, yo solo voy a escuchar y a ir leyendo la, la, lo que he impreso o he escrito, como se use. Solo escuchar y ver, no abrir la boca. ¿Qué estoy haciendo? Estoy haciendo que mi cerebro se adecua al sonido sí. y relacione las letras, porque el problema principal de los adultos es que nosotros ya venimos casi, yo tengo 40, o sea, casi 40, casi 40 años ya leyendo las letras de la misma manera, ¿no? Sí. Entonces, en inglés es diferente. Entonces, tengo que hacer entender el cerebro primero que las letras suenan diferente en inglés. Número dos, tercer día, cuarto día, empiezo a, a escuchar y repetir. Escuchar y repetir. Quinto día, todavía puedo seguir con eso. Escuchar, repetir. Ahora, tengo que alcanzar el punto de confianza, o sea, de sentir yo, yo creo que ya lo estoy pronunciando bien. Entonces me grabo, le doy un mogulso al celular y me grabo leyendo, tratando de entonar. ¿Se acuerda de lo que les he enseñado de poner la entonación en la sílaba? Sí, sí. ¿Sí? Si por ejemplo dice encourage, encourage, voy a poner en co, ahí voy a poner el estrés. Entonces tomo en cuenta todo eso, ya practiqué bastante, ahora me voy a grabar. Ya me grabé, va. Me escucho yo solo y se sí, bien, creo que sí. Ahora, ¿Qué me va a ayudar a mí a, a alcanzar la autocorrección? Voy a escuchar el audio que está en la página y el audio que yo tengo en el teléfono. Uno, dos, tres, pum. Y ahí voy a poder juzgarme a mí mismo. En un oído tengo el audio del, de la página y en el otro el de mi celular. Ey, dije mal esta palabra y voy tomando nota. Ey, qué chiva me sale esa palabra. Muy bien. Uy, creo que dije, dije muy mal esa palabra. Y ahí voy siguiendo la lectura. ¿Sí me entiendes? Sí, sí. 
Entonces, pues eso, créame, funciona muchísimo para atacar muchas cosas. Comprensión, eh, el um, listening y, y pronunciation. Ahora, lo que me gusta de esos audios es que son bien naturales. No, no, es, no es una canción, son dos personas practicando como naturalmente lo haría un americano. Entonces, ánimo. Si de sí, verdad sí. quieren mejorar eso, usted va súper bien. A mí me llega cuando habla y todo. No tenga miedo de expresarse, ¿verdad? Eso es muy importante. A equivocarse menos. Mante todo, si el teacher lo va a corregir, pues démosle, vea, con todo. No, yo en ese aspecto, no, no que me digan, ah, mira, hoy digo esto por decir, no, no tengo pena igual. Uh -huh. Como le digo, ¿va? yo mi intención es aprender para algún día. Yo sinceramente no sé cuándo me va a servir, pero sí quiero aprender. Y siento que poco a poco, y hay muchas cosas que, que sí las puedo, o sea, más tengo unos compañeros que ellos acaban de entrar y ellos todavía no me pueden mantener. Que yo les pudiera decir, va, hey, I'm a friend, how are you weekend? Que me digan ellos, ah, I went to the job at the supermarket, and then uh, playing soccer, I watch a movie, in the house. O sea, todavía no lo tienen porque van comenzando y estaban igual que yo. Por lo menos ese tipo de cositas mínimas uh -huh. las tengo, pero yo siento que ya no puedo estar allí. O sea, necesito salir ya de que alguien me pregunte. Quiero salirme del confort, como, como decía usted, dirigir otra pregunta. Hoy intentaba hablar con un muchacho que él estudia, aparte. ¿va? Y en las mediodías le gusta que cuando yo vengo al gimnasio que le pase hablando. Y hoy lo intenté ¿va? y lo... Él me logra comprender, yo sé que hay cosas que no las pronuncio como tienen que ser, o, o dirigirle cabal la pregunta, pero él me logra entender quizás por cómo está el casi el nivel mío, ah, me quiere decir esto, uh -huh. y me dice, ah, y él intenta, va, está menos que yo, entonces yo hay veces cuando ando, yo ando practicando cuando tengo Super tiempo bien. en mi trabajo, Super lo, bien. lo intento hacer así, o si no llega otro que él ha estudiado en la académica, va, no sé cuál, pero igual hay veces se pone conmigo ahí, él hey, what happened, what happened your boys, tell me, ¿qué pasa con tu jefe? Le digo, hey, como él tiene otro jefe, va ahí, medio, y ahí vamos. Entonces, es esta cosa que usted, otra cosa que yo he visto, que usted sí nos da videos. Estuve viendo uno de los que estuvo mandando, uh -huh. y sí sirve bastante, la verdad. La motivación. Sí, sí, o sea, que diga, hey, pues el profe lo mandó en video, va. Hay veces tal vez yo no he tenido chance, empiezo los fines de semana, veo los que me pongo a meterme, ¿verdad? porque hay unos que suben, son de YouTube, de nosotros mismos a la clase. ¿verdad? Entonces yo me pongo a ver lo que usted nos manda. Ah, ok, otro, ¿no? ya. Ah, ya ajá. Entonces yo digo, es, que veces, es, es importante pero, que usted se vea y, y trate de, de identificar. Eh, creo que ahí quise decir esto, no es uh -huh. así, ¿verdad? Eh, eso, eso sinceramente lo veo poco, los que veo más son los que, por lo menos que me han mandado, ¿verdad? en la uh -huh. pronunciación, ¿va? pero este casi digo yo sí, ya sé que me equivoqué, entonces me voy a los otros, siento que me ayudan bastante, y Super como bien. te digo ajá, no, son, que diga ella, hey, aquí está, ella, hey, aquí está, aquí está sí. mire, todo esfuerzo es bueno para alcanzar una meta, entonces, haga lo que haga no deje de hacerlo, ok mi meta es que Muy cuando bien. esté más, más viejito me vayan a echar de allí voy a buscar trabajo para irme <ríe> para Canadá, a Estados Unidos no de inglés, no, hombre, yo, pues, mire. sino de que, sino que diga yo, hombre si me voy a trabajar, a mí no me importa meter la cuma y para que me paguen. Bien, me voy mis seis meses. Tengo un amigo que se va cada seis meses, ha hecho una casona y él, yo estoy hablando con él y me estuvo contando y yo le dije, yo estoy estudiando. Y, Qué bueno, me dijo, viera que haya uno como da Villa, meter el va, no sé si a Canadá o Estados Unidos. Y mire, estoy en EPA, lo hay trabajando. Y, y el otro tiempo me vengo para acá a trabajar a EPA, mis seis meses, porque descanso seis meses. Y siempre está la, pero me dijo, ya compré un carro ahí, y ya me habían contado él. ¿eh? No, ve ahí estaba, ¿no? Sí, viera de que tiene una casona, un carro. O uh -huh. sea, solo lo que le queda es ir haciendo su fondo, pero ir guardando. Y digo yo, si no me queda de otra. Yo fíjate que los call centers, no sé, pero, pero igual. Tiene no que pasar, tiene que ¿No? pasar por ahí. De Para hecho, le iba a decir, sí, le iba a decir, eh, hay medios tiempos. Entonces, si usted trabaja, de, por ejemplo, ahorita de, no sé, de 8 a 5, digamos, un horario normal, podría en la noche hacer unas 3, 4 horas solo en inglés. O sea, pasar hablando en el call center, eso le va a desarrollar así el inglés. Esa presión, ¿Y se lo digo por parte, experiencia. Y hay alguna parte donde digamos que yo pueda estar allí aunque no me paguen. 
No, mm, no, no a ese punto no. Porque Por eso yo, yo ya veces... cuando ya llegue a un nivel de comunicación un poquito más le falta, un poquito más. Ah, y pues ya puede aplicar. La cosa yo... es probar en uno chafita, en uno así pequeño, ¿eh? Ah, Bien. Ah, yes. y... Así como el de la señora que echa pupusa allí, Canta 3 de San Discora. Ay, ayer que eres caro, te vas a ir allá a la pupusería, valen vale tres coras. <risa> Cabal, no, pues se hace para no cerrar la puerta, para no cerrar la puerta del call center grande. Y que yo en ese caso, yo casi no me gusta, y soy sincero, el call center, man. pero yo sí. sé que tengo compañeros que, ah, no, digo aquí, pues sí, que ganan bien, y uh -huh. no creo que su salario ande entre 600 y 500. Sí, pero no, la, no lo piense en el dinero, como usted me decía al principio. Véalo como Ajá. una oportunidad para desarrollarse lo más cercano que va a tener a otro país. De sí. la inglesa. Sí, entonces, sí, sí, ánimo. Bueno. Ánimo bueno. con eso. Bueno, ha sido un placer, Walter. Que eh, gracias, profe. Gracias, gracias. Good Igual. night. Ok, <risa> good night, teacher.